Notebooks are designed and made very tightly and because of that there is not much space for better cooling and you know that during the full load can get your notebook very hot and noisy which can decrease performance or lifespan and in this video I will show you how you can decrease CPU temperatures totally for free. So CPU needs some voltage for stable operation but every single CPU is different even if you buy two same Intel Core i7 7700K, you will never get totally same processor because it is extremely complicated component. And some of them are capable of frequencies as high as 5.1 GHz with low and stable voltage, but other can go only up to for example 4.8 GHz before they started to be unstable and that's the reason why the Intel is giving small reserve by setting factory frequency of 4.2 GHz to be sure that every single one is capable to operate at least on that frequency. And the same applies to notebooks. And because we can't increase their frequency, we can lower a little bit voltage, which is needed for processor to be stable. And again, because not everyone needs so high voltage, which is creating waste heat and higher power consumption, which can decrease battery life or performance by thermal throttling. We can do it by using Intel Extreme Tuning Utility, which I will be using today. Or you can use Throttle Stop, which is great tool too. So after you open it up, go to Advanced Tuning and choose Core. And now we will be changing core voltage offset, but please don't change anything else, because you can break some things if you don't know what are you doing. Now we will see that we can change voltage offset in this drop down menu, so down are higher voltages and we want to decrease it. So scroll a little bit higher. And let's try for example minus 0.010 volts and click apply. Don't go too low because your notebook will crash and you will have to start again. Now in left menu open stress test and choose CPU stress test for 15 minutes and start testing. This will test if lower voltage is stable for you, if no you will have to go higher. During the test you can watch temperatures if are low or thermal throttling. And once your test is done, we can lower our voltage by another 0.010 volts. And once you reach your maximum for CPU, when it starts crashing or will be unstable, increase it up until it will be stable again. At the end, run final stress test for a couple of hours or even over the night. For that, I recommend program called Prime95 for testing stability. And if you'll be okay, save it. And once you power on your notebook again, these settings will be applied and you don't have to have Intel tuning utility always opened. Now I will show you what I was able to achieve with this technique. So ambient temperature was 30C and I decreased voltage by 0.100 mV. And my temps before undervolting was 30C idle and 75C under the full load. After undervolting, idle was 39C and maximum temperature was 62C which is really significant improvement. Also here is the noise test, because acoustic was improved too, but my notebook was really quiet even before this, so I have to put my microphone really close with high sensitivity to hear fans. I hope that this video was helpful, if yes, you can write in the comment section what was your results and how much did you get from this. Subscribe, like, share and bye!